Hello friends, and welcome to the channel. This is Stormhaven Gaming, I'm John, and this is Timberborn. Okay, we are, what, day five uh, of this cycle. Um, haven't done anything really apart from play on. Uh, we are still in the process of gathering the resources for our Fountain of Joy down here. We're doing all right. Uh, we've got all the planks we need. We're shipping across the last few treated planks, and then we've got to get together 300 uh, metal blocks. Uh, we should have plenty. We have over 800 uh, in storage. So that is just going to be a case of getting the um, the stuff there. Uh, Water-wise, we are a little low at the moment. Obviously, we've just come out of a drought, so that is to be expected. Um, but it's not picking up as quickly as I would have hoped. Um, pretty sure I've turned all the, the water pumps back on. So, yeah, everything seems to be turned on. So we should pick up again. I'm going to keep an eye on that. We might need to put in a few more uh, water pumps around the place. Uh, we definitely want to put some more up here. We've got three currently, um, which should be fine for this district. But obviously we want to be sending money... Uh, sending money. Sending water... I've got money on the brain. Sending water um, to the other districts as well, should they need it. Again, they probably shouldn't. Each district... I mean, that's got less than a thousand in it. Uh, that has a thousand. That has less than a thousand. So, yeah, we are a little... Um, that is less than 200. Probably needs some more storage up here, but we don't have a lot of beavers in this area, so it's not too much of a problem. Um, but yeah, that that could be an issue. Um, obviously, we are still planting up our uh, maple over here. We are putting in another um, band of uh, earth. Once this one is in, I am going to shift over here uh, and start building up this area with dirt uh, in order to give us some more farming space. Um... Yeah, I'll probably just come right across to the edge of the map uh, and level off all of this area here. Uh, we can put another farmhouse in over this side. We can put in some different crops, maybe. But we'll see. That's what we're aiming for. Um, in terms of in terms of everything else, hmm. Yeah, I don't really know. Um, there was a suggestion that I'm not allowed to to finish the uh, the series until each district has. A fountain of joy. That could be problematic. We, we, we can certainly put it in this district somewhere. Um, maybe build up a little area behind here. Um, so it covers the, the housing here. Although the range is pretty big. So... Um, I mean, if we put it there, we'd cover the houses that we've got. And create a lot of space for more housing, should we need it. So that's not a terrible idea. Um, it does require access to water, but it doesn't need to be on the ground. In theory, I could put it on platforms, couldn't I, in this big lake. That's an idea. Um, over in the main district, um, hmm, yeah. Good question. Maybe in here? Um, maybe in one of the main waterways here? Let's have a look. Where would it reach? That wouldn't cover most of the housing over here. Uh, but if you put it there, it would cover all of it. Uh, I think we need 3x3 three three for the base, 5x5 five five for the rest of it. So... Mm. Yeah, I don't think it'll fit in there, will it? Okay. Hmm. What could we do? We could ditch some of this farmland because we do have 11,000 food. So if we were to ditch this farmland here, drop some space... Uh, uh, sorry, drop, drop down a tile, fill it with water. That's a possibility. Um, over in this district... Okay, yeah. Goodness knows. The only housing we have, or the housing we have, is there and there. Which is exactly right between the range, as it were. So we wouldn't be able to get it anywhere to cover both lots of housing. So... 
Yeah, again, there's not a lot of room. We could put it down in there. That would be an option. Uh, and in fact, that would also cover some of that housing there. Huh, okay. Okay, yeah. That would be the perfect place for that, wouldn't it? So we cover that housing there. That housing there would still be uncovered, but we could, in theory, put in another one sort of down here somewhere. Okay, something to think about. Something to think about. What I'll do, now that night has fallen, um, I'll rush on with this. I will get some of this started. In fact, we can probably do that now. We've probably got the spare bots and the spare dirt for it. So let's start filling in this. See how far we can get before trees get in the way. There we go. Trees have got in the way. Right. Uh, steps down. Steps down. And we will pop in. Where are we? Um, let's pop in the lumberjack that side. I don't think we're going to need to come this way. We're not. We just need to clear out these trees and these trees and some of these trees. So, we'll put in another set of steps down. That should be fine for the... Oh, no, it's not. We're going to need those as well. Okay, so... Another set of steps down. And, in fact... Oh, that's nearly completed. Oh, well, never mind. What's the range on that? Not good now that steps aren't made, but... Okay, well, well, we'll get that done. I'll get those trees out of the way, and then we'll fill this in with dirt. Uh, and I'll come back when we've made some progress. Okay, day seven, we've had a bit of a problem. For some reason, this area here wasn't filling up, and I'm not sure why. Um, there's no real reason why this should be blocked. It only temporarily, as you can see, only temporarily dried out. Uh, I haven't done anything to, to refill it, but it seems to have figured it out. Oh, that'll be why. That, for some reason, is at zero. That was a mistake. That was my mistake. Not sure why I dropped that down to zero. Maybe it was to fill up this, and I forgot to close it again. Oh, well. Situation remedied. Um, over here, as you can see, we have our fountain in. Yeah. It looks pretty, uh, pretty spiffing, doesn't it? Yeah. So it creates ore within 20 tiles, so that's all of the housing uh, on this side of this district covered. Uh, we still have some housing over here that isn't, obviously, but that's fine. Still haven't decided where I'm going to put the other um, fountains yet. Um, I think over here is probably the best bet, because that will cover that set of housing and this set of housing here. Um... Come on, Fountain of Joy. There we go. Yeah, so if we put it in there, that will cover ooh, not quite all of that housing. So we would need another one down here, I think. Yeah, that would probably... Somewhere like that would be the best place for, I think. Okay. So, oops, is that going to be, I'm not sure that's going to work, you know, really not sure that's going to work, okay, let's try, how tall is this, hmm, okay, right, so it's three by three. No, we don't want that, do we? We want that, that, and that, and then steps, steps, and steps, like so, and then we'll put the fountain on top, like so, uh, and we'll face it this way, towards the path. There we go. So that's our second fountain of joy going in, which covers all of that, doesn't cover those, but we're going to put another one over here. Um, we'll need 
a path down here. Um, oh, okay. Where are we? Steps. Steps there and steps there. That'll do it. Uh, how deep is the water here? It's not very. Yeah, okay, so we just need... Where are we? Three by three there, would that fit? In which case, we don't need steps there, do we? We just want that. And then... A fountain of joy there, we'll have it facing this way. Like so. Uh, and that should cover those houses. So, we still got those up there, and we still have, obviously, this district up here. We're up to a well-being of 37, which is pretty good. Okay, I'll spin on again. It's obviously going to take us a long time to get the resources together for that, because we don't have them anymore. Uh, we've got enough planks, I think. I think it's 300 planks um, each. Let's have a look. Let's see if I can find where I've built this. There we are. No, that's the one. Oh, 400 planks, but we have that. We have 1.4 thousand. Uh, 100 treated planks, which we do have. And another 300 metal blocks, which we still have. So, actually, we've got enough for both of those. That's fine. Okay, so we do have the resources for it. Right. I'll spin on. Okay, well, our second um, fountain of joy is in. Um, we have managed to skyrocket to a happiness of 42. Uh, we have now dropped back down to 41, but that's that's okay. We, we did briefly make it to 42. Uh, we've just had the drought warning. Um, three days until that arrives. This one here is just waiting for the last few metal blocks, which uh, we do have, so that's no problem. So that should hopefully increase our um, well-being a little bit more. That'd be nice. Um, over here, as you can see, we are expanding our uh, farming area. Let me just uh, fill this little section in with carrots. Uh, I'm going to switch over to probably potatoes next and then put in a grill. Um, so we've actually got storage for um, grilled potatoes already, I think. Yeah, we already have grilled potato storage. We don't have raw potato storage. So that would probably be a good idea uh, to add that in, wouldn't it? Um, yeah, that should be fine. And you will store... Where are we? Raw potatoes. There we go. Okay, in fact, uh, what's the range on this farmhouse? This rain, th this farmhouse has plenty of range. So, we'll start with that little section there. Uh, and then we'll fill this in with uh, more potatoes. I'll fill more of the, the dirt in as well. Uh, I, as I say, I want to basically level this whole section off and use this for uh, our farming. And as I say, I'll probably put another farmhouse down this end uh, to help. Okay, uh, we still have eight um, occupied beds, which is good. I have put in um, some more housing in these various districts. I put a, another one in there, and where are we? Uh, another one up here, because we were starting to get a few um, homeless beavers. We have a vacant bot spot. We no longer have a vacant bot spot. I assume that bot was out of fuel. That should be fine. Okay, um, sunflower-wise, we are doing absolutely fine. In fact, hmm, we'll probably find, yeah, we don't have a lot of storage. Hmm. Let's stick some more storage out here. That's, that's probably a good idea. Um, sunflower seeds, where are you? There you are. Right. Oh! 
Thank you, Water Save. Our other Fountain of Joy is in. Wow. Yeah. Brilliant. Okay. So, that is... Wow. Almost all of this district covered, then. Uh, all of these houses are covered. All of these houses are covered. All of these houses are covered. Uh, we don't have anything covering these houses and these houses. We don't have anything covering these houses. I think that is it for housing. Ooh, you know what? That might be worthwhile. What have we got? Uh, only three spaces there. One, two, three, four, five across. So if I take out those two trees and clear that space, use dynamite to bring this down, yeah, that might give us enough space. Right. Uh, too far from district centre. Well, we can sort that out, can't we? There we go. Now, um... Yeah, like that. And then we will mark these... Do we have a tree cutter in this area? Yes, we do. Okay, we'll mark these two trees to cut. And we will... Where are we? Unmark them for... Planting. Yeah, that should give us enough space to put in another one of those um, fountains, which should cover these houses. Um, we are burning through our resources, though. So, that might take a little longer than the other two. But I will speed on until the start of the drought, so we can see where we are there. Um, and see how long that's going to last. Right, there we go. It has started, and it's only going to be six days. That'll be fine. We, we'll have no problem with that. Um, okay, we have down here, cleared the space for our fountain, um, waiting for materials. As I say, that's probably going to take a little while, but we'll see. It might be done before the end of the drought. Who knows? Um, we are back up to 41 well-being. Um, I really do want to do something over here, though. Oh, you know what? You know what? Let's do this. Um, yeah. Like so. We'll fill this in here. And we'll use this as a little pool to put in the next of our... Uh, fountains. Come on. Uh, what's that? That's four. I'm going to need to put in... Yeah, I'm going to need to put in another strip of dirt beyond this to make sure it's all filled up. Okay, that's fine. We can do that. We have the dirt, presumably. Um... And we'll fill that in as well. Um, I'll leave that. I will put that in there. And... I'll close that off. I will... Where are we? Clear that. And I'll put our, a, a water dump in there. So that we can fill this. Yeah. Okay, so that will be this district sorted as well. Right. Six days. I'll spin on. Just over halfway through the drought, and the water level in this district has dropped enough to stop our um, Fountain of Joy from working. That's less than ideal. But it is only temporary during the drought. So, obviously once the water returns, that will be fine. But it does mean that that's, that's a bit of an issue. Um... I don't know whether 
turning all of these off during the drought is worthwhile or not. Uh, we seem to have plenty of water. Um, I haven't even turned on these ones and we still have plenty of water in this district, so... Yeah, it's probably not a terrible idea. Uh, we only have two drawing from this area during the drought anyway. Yeah, don't know. Uh, we also seem to be having some problems with the migration. Um, where are we? Over here, we are missing a bot. Now, we've got plenty of fuel, so it's not that it's out of fuel. We are literally missing a worker. Um, oh, we're not anymore. Good. That That's updated now. Yeah, we're having some problems keeping this district um, full of bots. We need 51, I think. Oh, no, 50, because I reduced it. Reduced it by one by taking one out of the hauling post there. Because it wasn't taking the, the additional bot that it needed from the 13 bots we have spare. So I'm not sure what was happening there. I don't know if there's a, there's a limit on the number of um, bots you can have set up to auto-migrate. Don't know. Don't know. Um, oh, one thing I can't remember if I mentioned or not last episode, um, but I did put another dam in across the back here, just to keep this area fertile, um, and so that when the water does return, we don't have to wait quite so long to fill this uh, area up, because we'll have some water already stored in here. That was the idea there, anyway. Um, but yes, I shall continue to spin on. And I'll come back at the end of the drought. And the drought is over. Uh, as predicted, we've done absolutely fine. We've expanded a little bit of the um, farming area over here. Uh, I am... There we are. I am leaving a gap in there. So we can put in a water dump. So we can obviously keep this hydrated. Because all of this has died during the drought. Because uh, we've just lost that little bit of uh, depth in here to keep it fertilised. So... We'll put in a water dump down there. That should hopefully keep the rest of it fertilised. Um, up here, we have finished. I am putting in uh, our Fountain of Joy. Uh, and obviously I'm going to move this water dump to here once that's complete. Um, down here, obviously that ran out of water. That one ran out of water. This one is in and didn't run out of water, which is nice. So we have another... Um, fountain of joy in there so once the water actually returns hopefully all of these will start working again and we can uh, boost our uh, well-being back up over 40 that's the plan um up here i haven't decided uh our maple trees have started to grow um we've just got to wait another what eight days nine days something like that before they start uh, producing maple syrup. I have removed the Forester and replaced it with a Tapper's Shack. So we'll be able to, uh, as soon as that starts producing maple syrup, we'll be able to uh, uh, start harvesting it. Uh, again, we are lacking bots somewhere. And it's over here again. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know why we're having a problem getting bots to fill these positions. I say, we have the spare bots. Um, and, and ten of them are in this district. So, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what's happening there. Uh, any ideas, let me know. Um, not that it's going to make a lot of difference, because I think this is going to be the last episode of the series. Uh, I don't think there's a lot else, really, we can do on this map. Uh, other than sort of building up this district, which, yeah, we are doing, but... I, I rather suspect this is the end of the series. But we will continue playing on for the moment. Uh, we still have, you know, a good five minutes or so left of the episode. Uh, so I want to obviously get this completed. Um, we are moving the planks up here. Let's have a look. Um, planks we still have plenty of, so that shouldn't be a problem. Um, treated planks should be okay. It will use pretty much the last of our... Uh, stock of treated planks, but that should be fine. And metal blocks, we are short of. Um, but we are producing them. So, yeah, we should be fine there. Where are we producing them? We are producing them here. Um, is that the only one? Nope, we got another one over here. 
and another one up here. So we should be producing plenty of um, uh, beams, uh, metal beams. So shouldn't be too much of a problem. Shouldn't be too long of a wait to get that constructed. Uh, and obviously once that's done, we'll remove the stairs and we'll pop in the um, water dump and we'll move this one. That might affect our fertilization around here, though. Just moving that over there might... Yeah, might affect that. So I might need to put in another water dump over here. Um, I was going to put in a, a, a farm and, and move that one over to down here. Um, I actually, we could still do that, couldn't we? If I put in the explosives there and the water dump there, we could put in the farmhouse just behind it, couldn't we? Yeah. All right, that's an idea. That's, that's what we can look at. Once we've got this constructed and the um, water dump moved over, we'll, we'll have a look at that. See, see what happens to the fertilization. Um, and, and probably move this farmhouse over here and put in a water dump. Yeah, that's the plan. Um, in terms of everything else, we are still very low on maple syrup. Um, we have 14, less than that now. Yeah, terrible. We're doing terribly for maple syrup. Um, but our maple sand down here is starting to grow. Uh, this is where I removed the... Um, uh, oak that was planted here and replaced it with maple. Um, yeah, we've still got a, a, a little while to wait before that starts producing, but then I'll put in a tapper's hut. Um, probably in here. We might as well do that now, actually. Yeah, let's pop a tapper's shack in there and prioritize maple. Okay. So we're just now waiting for the water to return. Uh, and our fountains of joy to start producing joy again. Okay, we have made it to day 12. Um, everything seems... We, we are still having problems with getting the bots to where they need to go. I th I'm, I'm certain that I've got everything set up correctly in terms of migration, but they're just not... just not getting to where they need to be. And I don't know why. I don't know what's changed. <laughs> Um, our maple up here is, is coming in nicely. Um, looks like we have actually already produced some maple syrup, but it's obviously already been taken um, to wherever it needs to go, really. Um, over here, we have a little bit, a very little bit, but we do have our fountain of joy in. Uh, it's being... Uh, fed by this uh, water dump here. Um, don't know if we're going to need to keep feeding it, but we'll see. Um, does look like it's slowly rising, so that's good. Uh, we haven't lost any fertilization, having moved that um, other water dump. We are still just about fertile over here. Um, so I do think just chucking in another bit of explosives there. Um, and another farmhouse behind it like that should be a good idea. And let's immediately plant a couple of sunflowers in there. Um, we'll get rid of this farmhouse once this is built. Um, and then we'll fill that with sunflowers as well. I mean, in terms of sunflower seeds, we are doing absolutely fine. Uh, we have 1.4 thousand which is probably enough. It's just a shame we don't have the same sort of level of maple syrup, but we are working on that. Um, down here, our secondary stand of maple is in. Um, again, not necessarily ready. To, oh, no, we, we do have some ready to produce right there. Are you, are you doing that? Yes, you are. I can see you right there. Hello, Zodjavuk. Good work. Um, oh, what I need to do, actually... Oh, no, I've already done it. I've already set that to supply. That's good. 
Okay, so over here, in this district, we are in the process of putting in our final Fountain of Joy. So we are just waiting for these uh, resources to come in. Um, yeah. So, treated planks. Yeah, we have 40. We need 80. So we're halfway there. Uh, metal blocks. Yeah, we have 48. We need 300. That's going to take a little while. Um, let's have a look. Is it worth... Yeah, it probably is. It's worth putting in another um, smelter over here, isn't it? Um, we have sp uh, spare power on there. So yeah, let's do that. Let's chuck in another smelter to up our uh, production. That's going to require one timber bot. So we are going to need to increase the number of bots in Robotown by one. And we still don't have enough. We're not getting them... Okay, I don't know. For some reason, we are not able to send those bots across anymore, and I don't know why. We have them spare. Um, all of them are in this district, so there shouldn't be any problem getting bots over here, but apparently there is. No idea. Genuinely no idea. But I will spin on, um, probably to the start of the drought. Uh, I want to get this, obviously, finished, but it is going to take a while. Um, so I'll spin on to the start of the drought and see where we are at that point. There we go. That's the start of the drought then. Um, six days again isn't going to be a problem. As you can see, uh, we have reached a 43 well-being. Um, obviously, we're not there anymore, but we did reach it briefly, which is nice. Um, the flooded buildings there are just the um, uh, water pumps over there in that top reservoir that I've turned on, ready for the water to disappear. Over here with this um, fountain, we are yeah, making our way towards completing it. Still not many metal blocks, but, you know, what can you do? So we've got another smelter over here in this district. Uh, we have two smelters over here in this district. We have uh, a smelter down here somewhere. I, I picked it out before and I can't see it now. There it is. So we have that there. Um, we have another one over there. So yeah, we should be producing enough metal. The shortage we've got at the moment is pine sap. Or pine resin, rather. Um... Because we were only collecting from this little stand of pine here. That was supplying all of our resin needs. And that just wasn't, you know, enough. Um, so I've put this section here uh, to also just produce resin. Um, this top level here is uh, to be cut down still, provide wood. Uh, but this section here is to uh, provide resin. Um, and I have done the same, where are we? Down here. This little strip of pine here. Um, in fact, you know what? Might as well fill in that gap there whilst we're here, mightn't we? Um, yeah, so we've got a, a tapper just tucked in there um, to pick up the, the pine resin when it starts coming in, which will be yeah in about four days. So by the end of the drought, this should start producing uh, some more pine resin. Everything else seems to be going okay. Uh, we have increased our supply of maple syrup quite considerably, which is nice. Um, our supply of catalyst is better than it was, but still not very good. Um, but we are at least now back on track to, to be producing that. Um, this is set to supply. Yes, it is. Good. I think I've already checked that, but never mind. No good selected. What are you... Oh, okay. That's fine. Um, where are we? Sunflowers. Store those. Um, and we need to put in... Come on. A path there. There we go. That should clear out some of this space. This now has no goods in stock, so we can demolish that. Uh, and replace it with... No, not potatoes. Sunflowers. There we go. Okay. That's where we are, basically. Um... 
I'm just going to wait. Um, still having problems with the bot, but I'm just going to wait until this statue is complete, or this fountain is complete. That's going to take a while. So I'm just going to spin on until that's done, I think. I'll see you on the other side. Okay, right. Uh, one day until the next drought. We're on cycle 37, day 13. Um, so I've played on pretty much for two weeks at this point. Um, our fountain is in. And that, I think, marks the end of this series. I think we've done really well. I'm, I'm really happy with how this has worked. I really like this power spillway. I think that looks great. It doesn't provide as much power as I thought it might, but it's still good. It looks fantastic, and that's the main thing. It's aesthetically pleasing. Look at that. How good is that? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I've put in some metal collectors, uh, some scrap collectors, rather, uh, on these two piles of scrap, because we're obviously using a lot of metal blocks, or, or were using a lot of metal blocks. Um, our maple syrup situation... Uh, has very much resolved itself. Uh, we currently have... Um, I can't even see where it is. Oh, there it is. It's 956. Which is... 950-odd more than we had before. Uh, our catalyst is back up over 100, which is good. Um, plenty of sunflower seeds, obviously. Uh, I think I've sorted out the um, distribution of bots... Not sure how. I basically just filled with everything until it started working again. Um, I'm putting in some more housing around the back here. Um, flattening out this land here to, to make space for it. I've put in a, a campfire there. Uh, and I'm going to put in some more. Or or I would be putting in some more um, uh, well-being stuff in this district. If we weren't about to, you know end the series. Uh, I did put in, some time ago, I did put in a, a healer here. Uh, so we can actually move medicine to the medical beds. Which is helpful. Yeah. I'm I'm happy. I mean, there really isn't much more we can do on this map, to be honest, anyway. Um, I mean, there are a few bits of land we can, we can fill in, but yeah, not really. Um, there'd be no point in closing this off because that would stop our spillway from working. Yeah. I think we're done. Let me know what you think in the comments below. I'll be taking probably a couple of weeks off before coming back with another uh, Timberborn series. Um, next one is probably... Well, I'd say probably. It's almost certainly going to be the Iron Teeth. Um, and I'm, I'm looking at uh, mods as well. See what mods there are. Um, see what would be interesting... For a series but give me give me suggestions in the comments below um please check out the other videos on my channel thank you very very much for everybody who's watched this series um thank you very much for everybody who comments who leaves a like um and please do check out the other videos on my channel give me suggestions of other games you would like to see me play and join us next time until then i've been john this has been timberborn please do take care of yourselves stay safe and bye-bye.